cameras are gone, we're still going to we're still going to be here because the concerns are long term concerns. Strong words of support from East Palestine, from not just the governor of Ohio, but also Pennsylvania's governor and the head of the EPA. They were all in East Palestine today, hearing concerns from homeowners while also giving updates on the cleanup. Yeah, that's when the EPA administrator, Michael Regan, laid out the plan to keep Norfolk Southern in line. Full transparency is the only option. The EPA is now in charge of cleanup and remediation in East Palestine and surrounding communities, including part of Beaver County. It says the days of Norfolk Southern doing so voluntarily are over. The railroad company will now be required to follow an EPA-approved plan with state and local input and forced to pay stiff penalties if it doesn't comply. If the company fails to complete any action ordered by EPA, the agency will immediately step in, conduct the work ourselves, and then force Norfolk Southern to pay triple in cost accordance to the powers granted by my agency. It's been nearly three weeks since the derailment released toxic chemicals, leaving people angry and afraid. The full effects of the disaster are still unknown. Norfolk Southern has countered claims that it's been slow to respond, but Pennsylvania Governor Josh Shapiro did not hold back at today's briefing. The combination of Norfolk Southern's corporate greed, incompetence, and lack of for our residents is absolutely unacceptable to me. Shapiro says Pennsylvania has already started independent water sampling from both the Norfolk Southern site as well as a two mile radius. He says he expects to have the first results in in a few days. I want every Pennsylvanian who is worried right now to know one thing. Our administration stands with you. We will make sure you have the information and knowledge you need to keep your family safe and we will hold Norfolk Southern accountable for their conduct. Pennsylvania residents who have concerns about their private well water should contact the DEP's Southwest Regional Office for information on how to get your well water tested. Governor Shapiro says officials will be in Darlington Township and elsewhere in Beaver County for as long as it takes. Norfolk Southern did release a statement after today's news conference. It points out it's been paying for cleanup activities and says it'll continue to do so. That includes reimbursing residents for the disruption and it says Quote, we're going to learn from this terrible accident and work with regulators and elected officials to improve railroad safety.